This video will provide a brief overview of Compliance Forge's Cybersecurity and Data Protection Program, or CDPP for short. Identifying the right framework for your needs is significantly based on your organization's compliance obligations and corporate culture. This is more of a business decision versus a technology decision. The four most popular frameworks are the NIST Cybersecurity Framework, ISO 27001 and 2, NIST 853, both the modern and high baselines, and the Secure Controls Framework, or SCF. If you're not sure what framework you should pick, you can go onto Compliance Forge's website and under FAQs tab, you will see a NIST 853 versus ISO 27002 versus NIST CSF versus SCF that contains worthwhile information on these frameworks to help you make the decision which best fits your needs. It's important to understand that controls are the nexus of any organization's cybersecurity program. Those controls are made up of your applicable statutory, regulatory, and contractual obligations. Regardless of which cybersecurity framework the organization aligns with, Compliance Forge documentation is controls-based and will enable your organization to align with that selected framework. It also enables a crosswalk so that one framework can easily map to other frameworks, laws, and other regulations. As shown in this graphic, policies and standards link to controls, so do procedures, metrics, and risks. Controls are at the center of any organization's cybersecurity program. When you purchase the NIST 853 high baseline version of the CDPP, you're getting cybersecurity documentation in the form of Microsoft Office products, such as Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. The CDPP's Excel spreadsheet provides mapping from the standards in the CDPP to supported laws, regulations, and other frameworks. The CDPP addresses the what and why questions in an audit assessment, since policies and standards form the foundation of your cybersecurity program. This documentation is focused on providing you with leading framework-based security policies, control objectives, standards, and guidelines. We also include an assortment of supplemental documentation that can save you a considerable amount of time. As you can see in the example on the CDPP product page on our website, it is formatted similar to what many organizations use for an HR handbook, a single document that is keyword searchable and is user friendly. This reduces complexity and redundancy. From a cost savings perspective, for your internal staff to generate comparable documentation for NIST 853 high baseline coverage, it would take them an estimated 800 work hours which equates to a cost of approximately $68,000 in staff-related expenses, and take about nine to 15 months worth of development time where your staff would be diverted from other work. If you hire a consultant to generate this equivalent documentation, it would take them an estimated 600 work hours, which equates to a cost of approximately $180,000, and take about four to eight months worth of development time for a contractor to provide you with equivalent documentation. The CDPP is approximately 1% of the cost of a consultant and about 4% of the cost of internal staff to generate equivalent documentation. We do provide PDF examples of all of our products. You can view examples by scrolling down about one quarter of the way down each product page to the product example section. You can also find examples and other useful information by clicking on the examples page that is on the menu bar near the top of the Compliance Forge website. Please note that these samples provide examples of our documentation that include a complete table of contents to help demonstrate the coverage, formatting, and level of detail provided in the templates. The example content that we share provides the best way for us to demonstrate the coverage and content since we can't share a complete PDF with a product or offer trial versions of our documentation. These examples are from the actual products for sale, so you get to view what the actual product contains and looks like. At Compliance Forge, we know effective cybersecurity is a team effort that involves the participation and support of every user that interacts with your company's data and systems. Given that reality, it is a necessity for your company's requirements to be made available to all users in a format that can be easily understood. Since words have meanings, we feel it is vitally important to provide examples from industry-recognized sources for the proper use of these terms that make up cybersecurity and privacy documentation. The goal is to establish a baseline understanding of what right looks like since this terminology is routinely abused even among IT, cybersecurity, and privacy professionals. We want to help fix that issue, so that's is why we wrote a guide to help explain how cybersecurity documentation is meant to be developed based on authoritative definitions of components that make up this type of documentation, such as policy standards, procedures, guidelines, controls, etc. It is well worth your time to download and read this guide. As a quick background on Compliance Forge, we are a U.S.-based company that provides high-quality cybersecurity and privacy documentation templates at a fraction of the cost as compared to hiring a consultant or writing it yourself. We've been writing cybersecurity and privacy documentation since 2005, where we keep evolving our product line as new laws, regulations, and frameworks are released. 
Since we write our documentation to address industry standards and design it to be scalable, our clients range from Fortune 100 clients with tens of thousands of employees down to micro small companies with only a few employees. Our documentation solutions range from policies, standards, and procedures that form the foundation of any security and privacy program to program level concept of operations documents that include risk management, vulnerability patch management, incident response, crisis management, vendor and third party management, as well as privacy and secure engineering. When you look at the costs associated with either hiring an external consultant to write cybersecurity documentation for you, or tasking your internal staff to write it, the cost comparisons paint a clear picture that buying from Compliance Forge is the logical option. Compliance Forge documentation is designed to be hierarchical. This architecture for how we build our cybersecurity and privacy documentation enables it to be comprehensive and scale to address evolving business requirements. This hierarchical model applies a tooth to tail approach for documentation so that it links policies to standards, procedures, controls, metrics, and more. It is important to look at your cybersecurity and privacy requirements from a who, what, where, when, how, and why perspective. This approach takes a holistic view towards your tactical, operational, and strategic considerations, since that matters when building cybersecurity and privacy documentation to avoid gaps in coverage. Cybersecurity is more than just processes, technology, and data. So right-sizing cybersecurity requires an appreciation for your organization's unique mission, its strategy, partnership, and compliance needs. This all trickles down to influence the controls that must be implemented at the tactical level. Compliance Forge sells semi-customized documentation as near turnkey. We design our documentation to follow industry-recognized practices that allows our customers to save considerable time and effort since we do the heavy lifting and allows our clients to focus on making minor adjustments to suit their specific business needs. When you buy Compliance Forge documentation, your expected edits are organization specific that only you and your stakeholders would know so that you can tailor these templates for your organization's unique business requirements. For example, with account management practices, a Compliance Forge provided standard might state an eight character password minimum with complexity requirements and a maximum life of 90 days is required. However, your organization may want 12 characters and change the password once a year. That is a simple edit on your end to personalize the documentation to be specific to your organization. That type of customization is based on your unique compliance requirements and risk tolerance. Please note that we do have consultants available who can help you with further customization, but that would be outside of the purchase price of the products and any consulting would be billed on an hourly basis. Our documentation solutions can save your organization hundreds to thousands of hours. Each product has an estimate for the amount of time it would take to generate equivalent documentation internally or with a consultant. We follow industry recognized practices so that we can provide policies and standards that are near production ready that require only minor customization based on your unique business practices. Policies and standards are meant to be centrally managed and these are generally tied to laws, regulations, and industry practices. Our heavy lifting in the research and writing of those documents make those near production ready requiring only minimal customization to meet your organization's unique business requirements. For procedure-related documentation, there is more work needed on the client's end based on how procedures are specific to the staffing and the technology and use of the organization. It is impossible for any procedure template to be completely turnkey since it requires the stakeholders and subject matter experts to fill in the specific details that only they know. Our procedures templates do the heavy lifting for these stakeholders so they can focus on filling in the process or tool-specific features that only they know. When you look at procedures, the cybersecurity team might be responsible to lead an audit or assessment but they are not responsible for documenting procedures, since that is up to the stakeholders and asset custodians to perform. It is somewhat like herding cats to get some stakeholders aware of their requirements, track implementation, and then document the procedures. This is where our procedures templates help those stakeholders by letting them focus on filling in details, not writing procedures from scratch. This benefits both the cybersecurity team and the stakeholders. This approach to managing both centralized and decentralized documentation needs makes Compliance Forge products very appealing since it saves both time and cost. Several Compliance Forge documents are essentially concept of operations or CONOPS documents that straddle the territory between an organization's centrally managed policies and standards and its decentralized stakeholder executed procedures. These documents serve as expert level guidance that is meant to run a specific capability or function within an organization's cybersecurity department. For example, risk management is a specialty within broader cybersecurity practices. A risk management team would be expected to use a CONOPS type document as a tool to help communicate risk management considerations and requirements 
to project managers, integrators, vendors, decision makers, and other stakeholders. It helps tell the story of how risk management principles are operationalized that support the organization's overall policy standards and procedures. Examples of Compliance Forge products that provide program level guidance to define a function specific concept of operations include risk management program, vulnerability patch management program, integrated incident response program, continuity of operations plan, security and privacy by design, information assurance program, supply chain risk management, and the secure baseline configurations. These documents directly support the organization's policy standards and procedures that establish the foundation of the organization's overall cybersecurity and privacy program. We hope this video helped answer your product-related questions. If you have any more detailed questions, we are more than happy to help answer them. Please email us at support at or give us a call at 855-205-8437.